Welcome to another NRL video. I'm Glenn Schwartzberg, and I'll be your host today for I Didn't Know I Could Do That in S-Space, Load Rules, specifically loading to multiple dimensions in a column. If you wanted to do an asymmetrical load of one column, and you needed to have it load into multiple dimensions, it's possible to do that. Most people think that you can just put a single member name into a column. So I could do something like say Jan comma actual and have it in a column or I can even use the cross dimensional operator Feb cross dimension budget and below you can see uh, what my load rule looks like. What I did is I took and I used the load rule act one which loads actual data into sample basic and I loaded it and I did a retrieval and as you can see it has all of the data in the action. I then took and used a cross-dimensional operator, making the last six periods go into budget, reran it, and it now goes into budget nicely. Now to prove that I'm not lying to you, I'm gonna actually do a demo and show you all of this. What we see is I have my act one rule, and if we look at that, it has everything loading into the periods and if I look at the header in my header definition everything is loading into actual I then created this act cross and in it in my header I remove that actual and you'll notice that I've now made January cross dimension to actual and over here um, the budget's going into August over here. So let's go ahead and run this and see what it looks like. So I saved off a script here on the server to make my life easier. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to reset data and just highlighting this and running it just runs the one line. So if I come to my smart view retrieval here, and I refresh. Oops, let me log on. Notice how everything is missing. If I then come back in here, I'm going to load Act 1 using the rules file of Act 1, and I'm going to execute uh, the default calculation. So it's all done. If I come back over here and retrieve, I get everything into actual. I'm now going to come back down here and I'm going to reset the database again. And show you that I'm not cheating. And everything is now missing. And now if I use this act cross and do the same thing that I did before, It runs pretty quick on sample basic and I refresh the data you now see that I have data in actual and data in budget so it worked just the way I wanted to this is a trick that I learned way back in version 4 I hope you find it useful there I found lots of uses for it across the years